Hello and welcome to Golden Arm Studios. In this video, we'll be bringing UE assets into Unreal Engine. And it's quite simple. You just need to do this if, such as you download something from Dropbox and they leave a UE folder in here and it'll end with UE asset. And it took me a while to figure out how to bring it into Unreal Engine properly. So let's dive in. So first all you wanna do, come to the video, just click on their link, the Dropbox. This part's all pretty simple. You just download and then open that up and make sure to extract it. And then once that opens up, navigate to the folder you want to bring in. I'm just going to go to this one and bring in a third person character. So then coming back in Unreal Engine, I'm just gonna throw it in mannequins. Right click on the folder you wanna put it in or anything inside the folder, doesn't matter too much. And then you wanna click show in Explorer. And then you'll see if I go out, it looks like the content browser. So inside this mannequin folder, I'm just going to bring over the folder into this desktop and then I'm going to drag over, click on that and then you can either drag or copy and paste into this folder. You can close these out and when you open up the mannequins folder you can see there's now the PP third person character. And a lot of the time it doesn't just work. You have to re-put in some materials. You might have to bring in some windows, the event graph. Let's click on that, bring that back. You can also come up to window and then bring back some of those windows. And you wanna click a pile. And usually not everything works. However, since this was directly from this project, it should already be set up, but you might just have to all click and reconnect things compile and if you had casted or get actor of class or anything like this it might not be valid and you might have to redo the connections and stuff which could be a pain but usually it should just work fine that's all for this tutorial for bringing ue assets into unreal engine 